Drop shipping is one of the most popular online incomes right now and for good reason. You can turn $50, $10 or even $0 into thousands of dollars each month. So in this video I'm going to show you how you can get started with drop shipping with $0. So let's just jump straight into it. Okay, what you need in your dropshipping business to be successful is a good niche, a product in that niche, a plan of how you're going to market, an online store, a good supplier, and have the right expectation. We'll go into all of these in depth, but these are just the basic blocks you need for building a successful dropshipping business. Okay, and the first thing you need is a good niche. A good niche is like the kitchen niche, the baby niche, the problem solving niche, the tech niche. What makes all of these a good niche is you know they're not going nowhere. Everybody will always need to eat food. Everybody will always be having babies slash kids. Technology is here to stay and it's only growing. And a product that solves someone's problem will always be here as well. You just want a product that you know isn't going to stop selling in the near future or anytime soon. Something with longevity. So the niches I said are good niches. But if you're going after another one, just make sure whatever niche you're going into has high demand for whatever products you're going to sell. Okay, and once you find your niche, you're going to need a product in that niche. So let's say we went with the cooking niche and we want to find a product that's related to the kitchen slash cooking you can find products by using ad spy tools like big spy or spocket but what i like to do is use tiktok the reason i like to use tiktok is because you can find trending products that's already doing very well with organic search just by going on there and searching up a product so let's go here to tiktok go to the search bar you can do this on your phone too it doesn't have to be your computer just search in kitchen gadget as you can see now you can see kitchen products that you could sell like this one right here let's look at this one five best selling amazon finds like all these products are all kitchen products and it has 2.1 million views 164,000 likes. Let's say you have one of these products and you got a decent amount of views and you was marketing the product, you can easily scale up a business just like that. And it's a lot of different, and I mean a lot of different products they have on TikTok that's around the kitchen niche. So if you find one that you wanna sell that's in the kitchen niche or whatever niche it is, going to TikTok, searching up kitchen gadgets or tech gadgets, whatever niche you're in, and seeing what pops up and maybe selling one of them will be a great way because if a video has 100,000 views or even 10 million views you know it can sell well because people already like it so it's already tested basically and you can see it's already working as well okay the third step is one that you can skip but I highly recommend you don't and that's a plan to market because if you skip this step it'll be very 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 hard to get customers unless you already have a built-in audience which most people don't so I highly recommend you stick to this step but it will cost you 20 maybe even less dollars to get started with this step and that's because you need to buy your product so you can create videos around it and market it so let's say this juicer right here was your product and you bought it and you started marketing it and what's what's amazing about when you buy the product and start marketing it you can make as many videos you want so let's say you wanted to make two to five videos a day with the sample product that you have and eventually one gets 6.8 million views i guarantee you if this was a drop shipping store you would have at bare minimum 50,000 sales from just this and 50,000 sales and if you're making 10 bucks per sale you can do the math that's a lot of money from that video so the best way you can market is just buying the product whatever product you're selling just buy it from yourself supplier or even offer amazon the same product so it can get to you quicker and once you do this create two to five different videos each day to put on social media because once you do this you can start growing your account too and eventually i guarantee you if you're putting it on all the social media platforms a lot of people just put it on one social media platform and miss out on the opportunities the other ones have for you you can use snaptick.app to remove the logo if you're putting on tiktok so you can put it on instagram and facebook pinterest and even youtube if you want to okay and the third step is getting an online store builder and i'm pretty sure you've heard of shopify this is the one most people use it's two months for a dollar right now if you want to use this way and i highly recommend you go to youtube and watch a few videos of how to build a nice store because let's say you don't and your store is just terrible looking and it looks spammy and looks like someone's credit card details is going to get stolen on your store it's going to deter a lot of customers so you got to make sure you have a nice attractive looking store and a free alternative if you don't want to use shopify is big cartel they're completely free you can start with up to five different products on their free plan they have free customizable things you can use a custom domain they even have shipment tracking so they have a lot of features that'll be helpful to you if you want to go this route i use big cartel for for a few of my stores and they are amazing and probably the best free store builder out here okay the next step is you need a good supplier if you don't have a supplier that offers fast shipping which is anywhere from 
two to 10 days. You can do maximum 14 to 15 days. A supplier that has great quality product and products that aren't too high with high shipping so you can have good profit margins. This is what you need to be looking for in a supplier because you don't wanna just go with any random supplier and turns out they have 25 shipping days or your profit margin is gonna be like a buck or less when you, you make a sale which is not profitable at all. You gotta look for all of these things when it comes to supplier. And if you don't know which ones to use, you can use CJ drop shipping which to me is the best alternative when it comes to aliexpress i hope you're still not using aliexpress in 2023 but cj drop shipping is an amazing supply you can see the shipping days they offer right here three to seven four to nine six to ten eight to twelve eight to twelve is their main days they have some for seven to fifteen which is all amazing shipping times when it comes to drop shipping and they have thousands and thousands upon thousands of different products on here and a lot of products for whatever niche you are in another great supplier you can use is source of goods this is another one of my go-to's they have a lot of products on here as well two million different products from a lot of big name companies they work with as well american express staples groupon jet barnes and nobles they've been in the business for 15 years with 3600 subcategories and 2 million plus products so i guarantee you'll be able to find a product on source of goods and they have a free plan which you can get up to 20 products on there so you don't have to pay a high monthly subscription with cj drop shipping or source of goods so i highly recommend you start with both of these suppliers okay and last but not least to have a successful drop shipping store is to have the right expectation a lot of people see drop shipping on social media and see these gurus making a hundred thousand dollars per week and think they girl they're gonna get in here and start making the same amount of cash but i'll let you know a little secret those gurus aren't making a hundred thousand dollars a week or whatever they're saying they're probably trying to sell you some spammy course and that's the reason they're showcasing you whatever they're showcasing so have the right expectations no it could take months before you see a few stale sales for me it took me around four or five i think it was might have been six different stores before i had a successful one that was making me around a thousand to two thousand dollars per month so it does take experience that you need to build up and it takes a while to see the return on your investment or you could get in here you could find a nice product and a week later you could be making four or five grand a week so you never know just make sure you had a right expectations though and know that this is a business and it takes time to develop the skills that you need when it comes to drop shipping all right and just like that we made it to the end of the video just make sure you don't skip out on any steps especially marketing one that a lot of newbies make is they find a product and then they just try to use a whole bunch of ads to market the product and that's about it that's their whole marketing strategy but marketing is very important like i said the most simple one you can use is just buy a product and create a social media account and just market it like that it does take a longer to see results but it is the cheapest and the most profitable way for the long-term investment on your product so i wish you good luck in your drop shipping journey and until next time